first alert weather with Cassie Campbell is sponsored by St. Francis Healthcare System. It's been a little bit of a cloudy day, still on that warm side, and a few of us have saw some brief light rain showers, but for the most part, we've stayed dry and just under plenty of clouds, as we can see here. And a live look in Perryville, still watching those winds come in pretty nice from the south southwest. We're going to continue to track those gusty winds as we continue really through the rest of the work week. Right now taking a live look at our satellite and radar though, plenty of clouds across the heartland. We are going to start to see a little bit of these clouds break up later this evening, but they'll roll right back in as we head into Wednesday. Right now seeing a few showers just to our north and then a few light showers in parts of southeast Missouri, but most of the rain is well off to the west and that's going to stick that way for the next few days before we start to see that rain roll in. So let's go ahead and see what Futurecast has to show. This is kicking us off around 730 this evening, seeing again some of that partial clearing in the clouds, but most of them stick around as we roll into Wednesday. Wednesday morning, a cloudy start. Winds are going to roll in from the south, pretty gusty. We're going to see those south southwest winds stick around throughout the entire afternoon. Calm down once the sun sets, the clouds will start to thin out just a little bit and then seeing some partly cloudy skies rolling in for Thursday. Thursday afternoon going to be pretty strong winds out of the south with some gusty winds off to our west. Could see a few light brief showers once again on Thursday, but we're going to see the showers roll in overnight Thursday into Friday. Looking at our rain chances for the rest of the week, do have that 10% chance for a brief shower Wednesday and Thursday. Still trying to pinpoint the timing on Friday and Saturday, shaping up for the weekend rain chances. As we get closer to those days, we'll have more timing on that. Lows tomorrow morning, though, are going to be in the lower 60s. 61 in Paducah, 60 in Marion, 61 in Cape. Highs tomorrow, another warm day. Definitely won't need the long sleeves by the afternoon. We're tracking 80 in Murray, 80 in Mount Vernon, 80 in Fredericktown. Really 80s all across the board with those partly cloudy skies. So the next couple of days, our average high for this time of year is around 68. So we're staying well above average through at least Friday. Then our next front pushes through, gonna drop those temperatures down 70 on Saturday, 66 on Sunday. But as that front pushes through, again, seeing the chance for some rain, showers and thunderstorms expected Saturday and Sunday. If you're trying to make outdoor plans, I would try and keep that in mind. Your evenings are going to feel pretty nice though through the weekend sitting in those 50s. But let me step out of the way here trying to make plans for Halloween. The sun is likely to come back. Now this is a far jump out so things could change by the time we get to Tuesday. But as of your outlook right now looking at the mid 50s in the afternoon then dropping down to those 30s at night. 